Alright, welcome back. Did the Molson Golden. God, this. And I'm sorry, I forgot my, my tripod. I was too busy getting, <clears throat> getting guns. Now, I said I, was I had an idea what I was going to get, but I changed my mind. I was going to get the, the Guinness. I got the Bigfoot Barley Wine Ale, 9.6%. Ooh, you got the big boy out. reason I got it, because we haven't ate yet. Put a little barley on us? No, we haven't ate food yet. That's what I'm saying, put a little barley down us. I think it's boss. Did you already show it? No. <laughs> Sierra Nevada. Bigfoot it. It's like a skunk. We're getting pretty good at this pulling half the beer down. I was walking up to the different camera. This is his first rodeo. You need to start bringing a pitcher of water out here so you can clean out the cups every time. Ooh. Well, most of the beers that don't ain't that bad, but we've had water. some where you got to go and rinse them out because it's such a thick beer that it sticks to the glass on us. Now, the barley wines I've had have been very, very sweet. Like, outrageously sweet. This has a, a well, IPA, yeah. an IPA smell to it. I'm getting a lot of. Uh, I kind of like the smell. I'm getting a lot of grapefruit hint and citrus hints. If it tastes like an IPA, oh, I think I'll like it. Find something to grow on. At yeah. first, it was like APA. Because it wasn't <laughs> APA. It the, <laughs> IPA. Wasn't it the bitterness that just. I didn't, yeah, I didn't, like the, I didn't like the citrus, and I still don't like the citrus. Because so. that citrus will bite you. Yeah. Yep, it's there. It tastes a lot like an IPA. I like this. It's a pizza beer here. Oh, God. What the hell? And pizza ain't here. Well, we're going to put this to the side. And... Just kidding. We fucked up, dude. We fucked up. You know why? Mm. What's the one thing we've always done and we did not just do? I would hate to chug this in a beer bottle. That'd be rough. Do it in the but really, for as high alcohol content as it is, it really isn't, you know, you know that burning. Mm -hmm. It's pretty smooth, especially for the percentages. Yeah, I like it. I mean, you can definitely tell it's creamy by the by the head. Oh, yeah. I mean, you can, I mean swirl around. You get head on yours. It's thick head. You can make a, a whipped topping for your pecan pie or something out of this. That's why the girls like it. They can't. His brother likes the whip topping, so guys, if you like shaking and making the cream, he's, he's all about that. He's Fuck the yeah. gobbler. No. I'm the swallower. See? You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. He's laughing with that red headed chinner dude over there. Man, shut up. You got Irish in you too. Yeah, but I'm not red facial hair. Yeah, you got more of the Indian, Jerry. I like this. I really. I mean, I've, I've done like two other barley wines, and I did not like them. They were too I like sweet. This. this has an IPA flavor, which I'm. I like. I, I really. I. I would buy this beer again. Oh yeah, definitely. What did it consider itself as? A barley wine style ale. Hmm. Just because it has the L name on it, I'm wanting to rank this thing high. Yeah, and, we, and we've having we've done the done the Sierra Nevada other ones. We've done the Torpedo and the IPA, and all those got good ratings. Sierra Nevada's got something going on. Mm -hmm. They they got some good beer. <sighs> yeah, and back to the honey brown deal. Dundee, stick to your honey brown because the other ones weren't great at all. Well, all of them are good except, except for the uh, stout. And um, I went to Byron's Liquor Warehouse and they had a uh, a new seasonal. Of Dundee's. Really? What is it? Um, I can't tell you. <laughs> I do know that they were at least two of them were different in the uh, the seasonal pack. Work me some more weekends. The porter. They had a porter, and they had something else. I'm gonna work me some more weekends. Get some money built up. I'm going down to Byron's. I'm buy a shit ton of singles. I ain't, I don't think we've had before. Okay. Just throw them in the fridge, and we can do however many what night or. All right. Here for a while, you've been buying them all. <laughs> it's not big. Oh, 
I need to talk to him about this. I'll talk to him about it. Man, just because I move. He went and by himself and tried to get it. He was like, oh, I ain't seen your videos lately. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, because he only did it that one time, didn't he? Twice. I haven't seen Twice. him in like two months, three months. Anyway, private issues. As you can tell by how slow we're drinking this, this is this is not something you want to drink. It, it's a full flavored beer. Yeah, it's full flavored. It might not be a stout full flavor, but it is a full flavor beer. And 9.6%. I, I can't believe it, really. That's no. 9.6. I can't, I can't taste it. It is too smooth to me for pretty much 10-point beer. You know what I mean? 10% beer. Mm -hmm. Which actually would be a 20-point beer or whatever. But That's all fun there. We'll put it to the side. That is some good stuff there. So let's rank it. Um... I get it again. That's what I rank it. Eight. I give it nine. Oh. For bar barley style or one wine. behind you every single yeah. one. Barley style ale, I mean. Uh, I've done the like I said, done the barley wine and I I didn't like them, so that's, that's good. good. That's good, so let's go to another one before the pizza gets here. Oh yeah. 